Hello all and welcome back to my channel JS Lab. So today we will discuss about bar graph. So the previous two videos we have discussed about how to draw, how to make line plots and how to make scatter plots and do the analysis or reach some decisions. Today we will see the bar graph. So bar graph or bar chart. Okay, it represents categorical data with rectangular bars with their height. So height is equal to their corresponding data present. So there are horizontal bar graphs and vertical bar graphs. We'll see that one and we'll take one more data set and we'll do some more uh, analysis. Okay, first we'll start with this one. Uh, first we'll, we require pandas, matplotlib and seaborn library. So we have imported that one and we and I have also imported the a data set called insurance this one we have used in the previous video as well okay so this are, these are the data available uh, based on age male or female and their uh, BMI the number of children and whether they are smoker or not and what which region they belongs to and what is their insurance charges so now for uh, drawing this bar chart I'm going to um, I'm going to group this one by, by region okay so by region by region so I'm using this data set in insurance in INS dot in that region and value counts how many are there okay so I'm going to do that so you can see this there are four regions southwest southeast northwest and northeast and how many are there that is also given there we'll draw a horizontal bar chart now so by uh, region that is the name of that then plot and in that kind equal to bar h horizontal bar chart we are interested in so you can see this one so you can see almost southwest northwest and northeast are having almost similar one only southeast is having a higher one so the same thing is reflected in the bar chart okay and if you remove this h from here if you remove that edge from here you will get a uh, vertical bar chart same thing i am copying here and removing the edge here only bar okay you will get a vertical bar chart the same thing in a vertical bar chart and this uh, we will use the same data set for uh, by children okay by children we will group that one ins dot children so number of children based on number of children will how, how many are having no children one children etc okay we'll take the counts take the counts and by child you'll see the data set so there are 574 with no children uh, 324 with one child like that and 18 with 5 child so these are the we'll, we'll draw a bar graph okay for that we will use the by child data dot plot kind equal to bar so in, in apostrophe okay so you can see here the graphic so it is easy to visualize and compare okay the same thing if you provide an edge here you will get a horizontal bar chart horizontal and vertical bar charts now we will use a different data set okay data of football players okay so for that i'll uh, csv pd.csv and i have saved it in the form of data.csv we'll see that data okay so here you can see the id and the name of the player his age and his photo and his nationality flag uh, then what is potential about overall potential then uh, his what is his club and his value etc okay all these things are uh, done here now we'll we don't need some uh, columns we'll uh, clean that one so we'll uh, from this data we'll remove the photo column flag club logo etc we'll uh, remove okay okay so we have removed that one and now so we have all we have removed all these uh, three unwanted columns and now we are interested in value and weight then name etc okay so here i am going to use using this code i am going to, okay, to group this one based on the nation okay so from the data 
uh, we'll select the nationality based on that one you count how many are there then the top 10 nations okay i'm taking the top 10 nations okay and by nations that means from the uh, from this by nation you take the first 10 uh, rows okay and uh, that uh, top nation to top 10 nations will uh, display here okay so you can see here these are the top 10 uh, nations available now i'm going to draw and the count so from uh, england we have 1662 players okay so based on that one we are going to draw a graph okay so bar graph so you can see here for nation plot kind of what is a bar and you can see here a writing here if you want to remove this one you just add this symbol here sorry not uh, this one okay you can see that uh, that writing will go and you will get only the graph so this is one example we'll, we'll go for another example in which you need to go for stacked uh, bar so now i am going to use another example another example in which uh, in the seaborn uh, uh, library we have a uh, data set tips okay in tips and i have loaded it to the tips and we will see what is a data set and it is a total uh, bill and what is a tip and whether it is male or female then smoker uh, what is a day that means sunday to friday and what's the time then the size how many are there how many are there okay based on that one and uh, next what i'm going to do is i'm going to group by okay group this data this tips data by uh, day and sex that means the uh, day and the male or female and also i'm going to sum this tip okay tips i'm going to sum and uh, i'm going to fill the not available values with zero i'm going to fill the not available values with zero and we'll see the data set so this is the this is the output so you can see this output here so uh, thursday friday saturday and sunday and male and female what is the total uh, sum of the tip they have given so based on that if you i'm going to draw a stack bar chart here the this aggregate tips uh, we have drawn the bar and we provided stack equal to true so you can see here on thursday on thursday see the blue blue represents blue represents the tip given by the male and the uh, this one may be given by the female based on that you can uh, do this one so uh, you can also try uh, in uh, different ways so about stacking uh, stacked bars i will prepare a different uh, video where, you, where we will get, take some uh, different data sets and we'll do some more analysis because stack bar uh, you can do it in different ways okay so in this video we have seen the about the bar graph and we have taken the uh, data set from the previous one that means insurance data set and we have done uh, how to draw uh, how to group the data and how to draw the bar chart then we have taken the football players list and we have done one uh, bar chart based on the uh, grouping it by nation and also this uh, based on the tips data in the uh, seaborn library hope you have enjoyed the video and in the next video i'll explain about the histogram and after completing that one uh, all together that means a line line chart bar chart scatter plot and histogram we will apply so to some uh, bigger data and we'll see how we can uh, come to some uh, conclusions based on this graphs okay thanks for watching bye